Hey, what's up YouTube? I'm gonna show you guys how to download the final version of iOS 13 onto your device. Yes, that's right, the Golden Master Edition. So you guys can get the final version of iOS 13 a week early. Now, unfortunately, if you guys attempted to install this Golden Master beta over the air, you probably ran into this, iOS 13.1 Developer Beta 3. Unfortunately, since there are two betas in progress right now, one being iOS 13 Golden Master, and the second being iOS 13.1 Dev Beta 3, there is no way to install the Golden Master version of iOS 13 via over the air. So with that being the case, I'm gonna show you guys how to upgrade from either iOS 12.4 or iOS 13, a previous beta, and upgrade to the latest Golden Master Edition. So starting off, you're gonna go ahead and want to connect your device to the computer just via a standard lightning cable. Now, we're gonna head over to the computer. You guys can navigate to this site here. We're gonna scroll down, and as you guys can see, we have the direct IPSW download links right here for you. Just select your iPhone right here. I'm using an iPhone 10 in this video. Give it a second to load, and then select download. Now, I went ahead and did that process off screen, so the IPSW file is completely downloaded, ready for the next step. Well, we're just gonna perform a manual restore within iTunes, so just head to the iPhone summary page, and here is really where the most important piece of information is. Instead of clicking restore iPhone, you guys are going to hold down the option button on a Mac or shift on a Windows-based PC. With that button held, we're going to click the update button. And here we can manually navigate to our desktop or wherever you just downloaded the IPSW file, select that guy right there and click open. Now we can select update within iTunes and now our phone is updating to the Golden Master Edition of iOS 13. Now remember guys, iPad OS is not quite out yet. It's not coming till a later date, so the final Golden Master Edition of that is not quite available. So just go ahead and enter your passcode on your iPhone if you have one to begin the restore. Well, thank you for sticking through it, guys. There we are, the restore has finished up. Update is completed. Let's see what final steps. It should just take us to the home screen pretty quickly if we set all of this stuff up later. But look at that, we can select dark mode, click continue, and there we have it, guys. Welcome to iPhone. And if I go to the settings app, scroll down to general, and scroll to about, there we have it, iOS 13, and right there, if you guys can see it, that is the iOS 13 build number. Anyway guys, now you can disconnect your phone from the computer once the restore has finished up. We can exit out of iTunes and you guys are good to go on your way. But as you can tell, we completely upgraded to iOS 13. We kept all of our data. It is kind of unfortunate that we have to use the computer to upgrade to this specific version of iOS 13, but it is well worth it. This is the final version that is going to ship next week to the public, but you can get it today, a week early. Anyway guys, thank you so much for watching today's video. The very last thing that I'm going to do that I do in all of my videos, I'm going to go to wallpapers and set a dynamic iOS 13 wallpaper so you guys can get a gist of what iOS 13 looks like. And there we have it guys. As you can tell right here, we can turn on and off dark mode. So many awesome features. Anyway, thank you so much for watching this quick video. If you guys liked it, you know what to do. Stay tuned for more awesome content, but until next time, this is Tony, signing out.